<laughs> anyway, shout out to everybody who's here with us on Social Friday on Wine in the Morning. That is Rajiz, the DJ, serving in the music. I'm going to you with from 7. Now, it's not about to stop. Hadi 10, not Rafika Tamati. And kwa sasa, we have another interview on this particular edition of Social Friday, in any travel edition. We'd like you guys to reminisce uh, with us. Uh, we are asking that question on Facebook. What destination, what is this destination that you've been to that you'll never forget for good or bad reasons? Tell us on our Facebook page at Y254, uh, Twitter at Y254 channel, Instagram at Y254 underscore channel. Without much further ado, it's time to introduce uh, the second guest of the day. And she goes by the name Eve Lucky. And she's a CEO and founder of Dynasty Expeditions, which is a tour and travel company. Karibu sana. Thank you. All right, uh, your camera is number three. Mm -hmm. uh, introduce yourself, just in case I missed uh, to mention something in your credentials or in your CV. Okay, uh -huh. so I go by the name Eve Lucky Karitu. Uh -huh. I am the CEO and co-founder of Dynast Expeditions. Uh -huh. I am a first born. Uh -huh. I love travel uh -huh. and yeah. It's about time to answer to a meme zama first born. <laughs> Mezo ya ma last born sana. <laughs> Nini ni ma first born wana fanyanga ina kubo. <laughs> Kujona kishwa. Na nyumba si yao. Anyway, tutanza kutoa mimi zama first born sasa kwenye kunaenda. Anyway, thank you very much and karibu sana uh, to Social Friday on Wine in the Morning uh, and gracing this travel edition that we have. Uh, did you travel over the, over December? Over December, yeah, locally. Locally? Yes. Uh, yeah, yeah, that is true. Yeah, I went to two destinations. Uh -huh. I went to Nyahururu, uh -huh. in Kipia County, and Eldoret. Uh -huh. Yeah. Courtesy of Dynasty Expeditions. Yes. I am Dynasty. No, courtesy of Dynasty. <laughs> <laughs> you are Dynasty. I am Dynasty, Expedition. Yes. <laughs> yeah. So wherever you go, it's Dynasty. It's Dynasty. Expedition. Yes. All right. Uh, so, one thing I wonder... Running a tour and travel company, I'm guessing you have trips almost every weekend. Do you have to go to each and every one of them ah. to be to have that one on one on one with your clients and get that personal touch? And then number two, mm -hmm. do you get bored of going to these trips sometimes? So Anza na swali ya Kwanza na Ya Kwanza. Yes, I. I, I, I have to be in at least all of them for uh -huh. their personal touch, their uh -huh. personal experience. Uh -huh. I love mingling with people. Uh -huh. I am a social butterfly, so uh -huh. I think yes. Social butterfly? Yes. Love that. <laughs> but like when they get through, I'm, a, I'm this a social <laughs> butterfly. butterfly. Okay. Yes, so I believe I will need to be in all the trips that we have. Mm -hmm. Number two, what was the second question? The second one is, do you ever get bored of going to no, these no, trips no. over and over and over again? No, no, no. Uh -huh. I do not get bored at uh -huh. all, at all, at all. So if we join uh, Dynasty Expeditions, there's no border? There's no border? That is guaranteed. Yeah, guaranteed. How did you get into this space? How did I get into this space? Mm -hmm. um, I've always had interest in travel mm -hmm. since I was very young mm -hmm. i did i majored when in when do i to holiday kifika mom natakunda kwa auntie <laughs> yeah kuzurura uh -huh. everywhere so i majored in tourism management uh -huh. in strathmore graduated went uh -huh. to the tourism field uh -huh. so i've been working for for four years uh -huh. in the tourism industry uh -huh. travel and tourism mm -hmm. and yeah that's when i dis came last year 2020 is when I now decided to venture into this business mm -hmm. as a career all right all right yeah. so it's a career, it's uh, a career. Right about now yes and uh, since you've been in the in this uh, uh, tourism field yeah what's your opinion on Ni the Naomi Campbell situation Naomi Campbell situation I th I think um uh, congratulations to her for the congratulations um, to, to Naomi her, Naomi her <laughs> Uh, yeah, with, uh -huh. <laughs> yes. With the current situation, I believe uh, it is a good thing, but mm -hmm. I don't think there will be much different than that now, mm -hmm. because you see, the US was the most hit mm -hmm. uh, country with COVID, mm -hmm. so business is picking up slowly. We are now at thirty percent. Mm -hmm. I believe by the second uh, second quarter of the year, mm -hmm. we will be at fifty. So mm -hmm. uh, with Naomi, maybe. It will, as take time. it will take time as we progress All because right. of the current situation. But I think she's a good fit. She's a good fit yes. for the job. For the job, yeah. Because connects 
na masongo kule. Yeah, and together with the Joe Biden, I think it's a it's a, it's <laughs> it's a, a good combination. It's a great combination. I like where your head is at. <laughs> I like yeah. where your head is at right there. Thank you very much for that one. Okay, so um being uh, somebody in the tourism field, uh -huh. uh, we are told that local tourism has grown tremendously uh, during the year of 2020, the year of COVID. Yes. Uh, do you second this motion? Yes, I second and third and fourth this oh, motion. Right, <laughs> right. Because at, and at least with the COVID, co the COVID uh, situation was, mm -hmm. was it came with the positives. Mm -hmm. You see, most people, uh, most Kenyans prefer mm -hmm. to travel outside the country. Mm -hmm. So with COVID, it gave us the opportunity to explore mm -hmm. Kenya as our desti as a travel destination. Mm -hmm. We've seen the uh, how KTV has been marketing the country mm -hmm. very magical. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's I am proud to be Kenyan because we get to find the hidden treasures in Kenya, mm -hmm. and people are willing to now. Uh, explore Kenya, which mm -hmm. is a good thing for me, and I, I thank COVID for that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. All right. Mm -hmm. So uh, COVID has come with the goods it's and the good, bad. Yeah. And one of the goods is that it has encouraged Kenyans, Kenyans. to travel more and more and more and more. Yes. And more. All right. Yes. I Especially like the coast. I mm -hmm. love the coast. Uh -huh. So I saw when I think when the president lifted the ban around the, towards the end of 2020, mm -hmm. there were memes going around how Kama Ujenda Mombasa, wewe, you're missing out, uh -huh. which is a good thing. Uh -huh. People are saying you're flooding coast, but I, I like it that way because people get to now know coast as a destination. Uh -huh. You don't need to go outside the country. Yeah. Mm -hmm. so it's I get that. All right, so when thing. Kenyans think travel, uh, the first thing that pops in their minds is coast. Yes. Right? traveling locally yeah what's your take on that and do you uh do you think it's it's the right way to think as a kenyan considering you've been to all these destinations are they missing out on something i, I think it depends on someone's uh interest uh -huh. you see the kenyan coast i think the people who think of the kenyan coast are mm -hmm. people who love water and beach mm -hmm. but we have so many destinations that people can go to mm -hmm. we we also have, uh, yeah, I, for, for me, I think it's a good thing. I don't mind people mm -hmm. flooding the coast because mm -hmm. it's a plus. Mm -hmm. But I think Kenyans should try and explore other destinations. Mm -hmm. We have nice destinations like Takawiri Island, mm -hmm. Mbite, mm -hmm. very nice places. Mm -hmm. the, the You've beach, been to all these places? Yes, with the uh -huh. beach, uh -huh. nice sandy beaches, uh -huh. just like the coast. Uh -huh. So I think it's more of... Kenyans to be more to be aware of, of uh -huh. these destinations, or for us in the travel industry, uh -huh. to to make them, to more, make aware. them more aware. That is the reason we are here. Yes. We are to cover the travel edition, your social Friday. Yeah. And thank you very much for pointing that out. Mm -hmm. I'd like to get into uh, some uh, personal questions, if uh, you don't mind. No problem. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> but they are fun questions at the same time. <laughs> All right. So, uh, huh. mm hmm. Let's start with the last TV show that you watched and why. Last TV show I watched mm. was uh, Zumbo's Just Desserts. It's a reality, a, a reality cooking show uh -huh. where... Uh, Made in Kenya? No, no, uh -huh. not in Kenya, in mm. Australia. Uh -huh. We have, where we have home cooks uh -huh. who come to the, to the, to the show. Uh -huh and make desserts, uh -huh. very nice desserts. Uh -huh. So I like the show because I got to know you can eat desserts, uh -huh. but they're healthy. I never knew that. Uh -huh. Yeah, because what I knew was desserts, desserts is ice cream, cholesterol. Uh -huh. Yeah, so it Sweetie, was cakey, sweet. Cakey, yeah. Okay. So, yeah, I saw you can make desserts from cucumber, uh -huh. pepper, just healthy. <laughs> <laughs> and they're sweet. That is cute. Utakula nyama lafu umalize na cute. No, like I like I ask I ubuya kufumzi umalize na cute. Okay. It was a nice show. It was a nice show. Mm. But you love living healthy, I can tell. Yes. All right. I try. It's a passion. You I, try. Yeah, I try. Okay, okay. Eh, but you are not kukula nyama. <laughs> anyway, okay, as we proceed, what's your favorite song from the 90s? Yeah, my brother, there was was some hymn song uh, that Raji Zakwa and I. Favorite song. It's Let me hope a, 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 a love right. song. Uh -huh. I, I think I heard it the first time during my parents' wedding. Uh -huh. How does it, is it called? I Swear by 
all for all for one. I, I swear, swear by the moon. Yo, <laughs> yeah, that's that's you know, you're in a request. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, yeah, just, uh, <laughs> all right. Hey, anyway, I like that one. I like that one. Uh, hum. So, what were you like in high school? If you can remember. I in, was. In a few words. Just one word. To me, two adjectives. Come and build that. Yeah. I was. One word. Mm -hmm. Mischievous. Mischievous. Yes. <laughs> wow, you don't seem like it. Yeah, that that. That that's is the, the worst. Whole meaning. <laughs> Form of mischief when you don't seem like you're mischievous. All right, yeah. I like, I like. Uh, so let's move on. Uh, what's the funniest thing that has happened to you uh, in one of these trips? Funniest? Yeah. In December when I was in Nyahururu. Uh -huh. I always laugh at people when they uh -huh. fall. Uh -huh. So this is what happened. I went to Nyahururu. <laughs> yeah. It you're was raining, okay. raining heavily. Uh -huh. I had hot coffee uh -huh. on my this hand. Uh -huh. Then snacks, Swiss uh -huh. roll and some samosas. We had just stopped on, on the while driving uh -huh. to buy some things to eat. So I don't know. I don't know if what happened. I just fell down, and there were people around me, and uh -huh. it's raining. My coffee fell. So I felt the pain, but I just remember how I laugh at people and they laugh. So, so I, I I laughed at myself <laughs> <laughs> until so now. Karma is real. Karma is real. Karma is real. So <laughs> I was like, oh god, I like did I just fall? <laughs> <laughs> oh. Yeah, yeah, that was the funniest thing. Okay, so let me, let me, let me, let me, let me find another good one for you. Mm -hmm. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Mm -hmm. So let's say you woke up one day uh -huh. and you had 2,000 and read emails uh -huh. and you only had to read like 10 of them. That ten. is the only time you can get. Mm -hmm. How would you pick the ones to read? How will I pick? Mm -hmm. I will read from the subject mm -hmm. and see which ones have return on investment. <laughs> <laughs> so, so you'll be checking the subject, subject, yeah. subject. So if if let's if now it's a company email, I'll look for the ones that are booking requests. <laughs> reply those so ones. people, you better book your request <laughs> and how can they get to book their request now that you're that day? Yeah, so you can uh -huh. check out our website, uh -huh. dynastyexpeditions.com. Our social media handles, Dynasty Expeditions, uh -huh. on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, and YouTube. Uh -huh. um, you can email us on info at dynastyexpeditions.com. Uh -huh. And you can also DM me on my personal IG, Lucky uh -huh. Karitu. Strictly business, yeah? Strictly business. <laughs> 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 all right, all right. Thank you yeah. for that one. So uh, the last guest we had, Alex, told us <laughs> Kenya is... One of them, Kenya is very beautiful. It doesn't even have to need to be compared. Yeah. So as a person who has traveled in a scale of 1 to 10, uh, how beautiful is this country of ours, Kenya? Because people who are living in Kenya be looking at uh, pictures of New York, uh, mm. pictures of, uh, uh, of Cape Town mm. and the rest of them uh, and yeah. think that, oh, it would be much better to go on vacation there than this place. How beautiful is Kenya in a scale? In a scale of 1 to 10, I'll say Kenya is... At 10. 10? Yes. It's at 10. 10. <laughs> <laughs> I'm still give it a 10. Uh -huh. Because it's a very beautiful country. 10? Yeah. I'll give it a 10. Okay. Yes. <laughs> Confidently. Uh, all right, all right, all right. But I like, you yeah. have your reasons, and uh, people confine themselves to the cities, what I say, ma, this part of the city, Nichafu, mm. which is a very, or oh, a small place, compared yeah. to the rest of the very big, uh, vast, beautiful Kenya. Yes. Thank yes, you very yes. much for that one. It's about that time mm -hmm. that we give this DJ right here mm. a challenge. Are you ready? Yes. It's your chance. Uh -huh. So I'm going to ask you a few questions okay. uh, to help you give the DJ a challenge. Who's your favorite artist at the moment? Jason Derulo. Jason Derulo. Uh -huh. <laughs> wow. And I just see what Cardinali. Huh? I was hoping you say somebody from Kenya, but it's okay. <laughs> anyway, uh, so Jason Derulo, it is for you. Yeah. Um, which period yeah, Jason Derulo was your best? Personally, I'm a fan of, say, Drake. Mm -hmm. I love his album, uh, Nothing Was the Same. That's my favorite album, that period, Drake. Mm -hmm. Which period, period. Jason Derulo uh, is your favorite? I think when he used to date Jordan Sparks. <laughs> Are you a fan of the music? Or? 
<laughs> okay, the oh. music. Let me tell you, the music is sky's the limit. Yeah. I love that song. Yeah. I think that's when I, I fell in love with Derulo. Sky's uh -huh. the limit. Uh -huh. I'm running solo. Mm -hmm. uh, which other one? Those marry me. Uh -huh. yeah, There's a number. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So the <laughs> challenge is Raj is achieve ngoma tattoos and just on that rule. Atapata. Love not to all. Atapata. Tattoos and just on that rule. All right. Thank you very much for that one, Raj. As you line that up, uh, please remind them your social media, how they can find you, and how they can get to do bookings, and uh, how they can get to get discounts as well. What can you want to do? Yes. 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 Yeah, so you, you can get us on our social media platforms. That is Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, and Twitter. All of them, Dynasty Expeditions. Our website has all the discounts, all the offers, especially now that Valentine's is coming up. Mm -hmm. We have offers lined up. And but you have fresh up. Yes, <laughs> yes. And for, you don't have to have someone. We have a group travel uh -huh. on uh -huh. the 14th, just here to in Taraquet. Mm -hmm. It is going to be a fun, fun meet and grill experience. Uh -huh. And yeah, you can DM us. Uh, mm -hmm. We are always active on social media and we'll mm -hmm. respond. Anything you want, budget friendly, mm -hmm. we'll custom make it for you. All right. Yeah. Thank you very much for that one. And on to a question on Facebook uh, today. Which is that destination that you've traveled to that you'll never ever forget? Wasini Island. Wasini Island. Because I love water uh -huh. and the, the, the sea life at Wasini is mm. very nice. All right. So different types of fish, the uh -huh. corals. I uh -huh. love the Where place. Where is Wasini, Wasini in terms of geographical? Coastal. Region? The coastal. coastal region, yeah. All right. Ukunda. Uh -huh. Ukunda, yeah. You know, these sides of Ukunda. Ukunda, yes. All right. You'll never forget that one for sure. Yeah, I'll Thank you very much for one. coming through. Tunakupenda sana. We appreciate you. I and love keep it doing too. what you're doing. Encouraging Kenyans to travel. To travel, uh, yeah. That is Karitu. Yes. I like that name better. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> that, is uh, that is Karitu, uh, CEO and co-founder of Dynasty Expedition. Find them uh, online and book your date. Book your date to travel. Unwind. And let's end this. Is it my stress? The the kutukanana social media. What one atukanana juwa kuna stress? Yeah, yeah. What one atembe? What one atembe? Travel actually aids depression. Uh -huh. Yes. Travel in a sana sana depression. sana with depression. All yeah. right, we have come to the end of this. Uh, we are going to listen to some music. Jason Darulo is going to feature the uh, courtesy uh, of uh, Karitu here to Tamsav Kidogo, uh, but a lot of other 